Hey guys, Alex Sturgeon, Hobbytown, Hobbyplex, and as promised, the month of May is just dousing us with unboxings, and I was super, super happy. I thought it might be here last week, so all day Friday I was just kind of like fiddling around, wondering when it was going to show up. It didn't show up. It showed up today. This is our first delivery from Traxxas, the 2021 Ford Bronco uh, TRX4. We've got one for you to kind of fiddle with if you're here in town, and uh, look over, place your pre-orders. And then we got a whole bunch coming from Traxxas, but I wanted to unbox this thing and just look at the, uh, mostly the body. You know, we all kind of know what a TRX4 is about, but let's check it out. Get this out of here. Yeah. Talk about that here in a little bit. All right, pull this off. So there you go. So. Uh, you know, I'm not a car person. Anybody who follows this channel on a regular basis knows if it's not an RC car, I don't actually know a lot of about stuff. But I will say that when I first saw the new version of the Bronco a couple years ago, it like popped up on one of my feeds, I was like, well, that's actually really cool. So, um, so now we have it in RC car form. There, I think, believe there was like a new bright uh, RC car that guys were buying and taking the bodies off and fitting them on like a like a 12.1 or a 12.3 wheelbase crawler, well, now you don't have to do that. Now you can get the Traxxas body um, or the Traxxas TRX4 here. Tinted windows, you can see the uh, details here. So you got your mirrors, your uh, windshield, your faux F-A-U-X uh, winch right here. That is an actual functional fair lead though, so when you do get a winch, like the new Traxxas winches, that'll be coming out. You can stick that on there. Look at that, little D-rings. Got a nice molded bumper as part of the whole deal. It still has the inner fender wheel, uh, fender wells. Let's take the body off and we'll see. I really like these new rims too. That really stood out to me um, when I first got a chance to look at this on the internet. Now that I see it, I like those a lot. They're still plastic, but I mean, you know, that's the way it is. Okay, so check this out. Part of the cool thing about this new body is these tabs. So we'll bring it in and you guys can see I don't know if you guys can see that. Right there. No body clips with this body. So we're getting a lot more scale from Traxxas. You're able to just reach underneath the here and flip these little tabs. Let's see if I can do it all in one take here. And then you got them on the other side. Look at that. Wow body's heavy so here's the underneath of this body and you can see um, all the plastic reinforcement these are your actual body mounts you can see these little tabs here they grab uh, these body mounts that are molded into the fender wells look at that that is really cool so no body clips protruding you know the um, the SCX 10 3 that I have no body clips on the outside, but you still use the body clips on the inside to hold the body in. Well, here you go. Don't have to worry about that. Don't have to worry about losing any body clips. Um, Traxxas is really working hard on that system on all their new releases, it looks like, that they have out. Uh, trying to see if this rear wheel is actually functional or not. I think it might be. It's soft. You can see that it's ready for lights. So you got your... Um, you got your light buckets, your molded in uh, light fixtures. Look at that front bumper. That's an actual plastic molded bumper. This is not bad. Tinted windows. So if you're in Iowa, you get pulled over. Um, door handles. That's pretty cool. And the rest of it is kind of just a standard TRX4. Let's take a look at it here. So the main difference on this chassis is the uh, the, the new fenders um, with the body mount system. Um, it's ready for rock lights, of course. And uh, everything else is pretty standard TRX4. You got your XL5 uh, that can handle up to a three cell, your Titan 21. It This one will come with the um, two speed and the uh, front and rear uh, diff mechanisms. Of course, the Traxxas shocks, some of the best um, in the biz for the scale crawling world. They come standard on here, metal shocks. Got your link setups here. Of course.
course portal axles we all know about that now I like how this bumper has kind of like a front skid molded into it um, that's something a little different and uh, yeah, the rear bumper you got yourself ready for a hitch get yourself a uh, trailer not too bad uh, what's really cool about the TRX 4s, if you don't know about them, is you can use a standard size two cell or three cell battery. So if you have a lot of Traxxas cars and you already have batteries, you can put them here. But you can also get their two and three cell batteries that are used for like a Revo 1 16th and stick it right up front here. It fits perfectly and uh, you get a little bit more weight in the front, a little less weight off the back. It can crawl a little bit better. They also sell stuff like overdrive and underdrive for this thing to make it... Uh, crawl up hills even better than that and make it turn a little bit better. And then of course the new items that we'll have out from Traxxas include a light kit for this thing, a functional uh, winch with a key fob, and uh, I'm really looking forward to seeing that come out. Um, you know there's already winches and stuff out there but just the fact that Traxxas kind of has their own. I don't think it's the most powerful in the world, I think it's like 10 pounds, but uh, still it's going to work really well. and. Uh, since it's made from Traxxas, it's meant to go on their TRX 4s right out of the gate. So, tires look good. I believe that uh, these are the Canyon Trails. They're nice and soft. And again, I like these new wheels. That's uh, pretty sharp looking. They're kind of a kind of a metallic black. Put the body back on. See how easy it is to put this body back on here. So, without even really looking. There it is. Press down, pick it up. That's pretty. Cl that's pretty slick, guys. I like that a lot. That's pretty rad. <laughs> okay. Uh, the rest of it. What do we got? So we have your standard uh, TQI. It's ready for your Traxxas link, and it's got your two-speed and your diffs up here. Um, standard stuff. Everybody knows what it. Traxxas controller is all about. The cool thing about the Bluetooth enabled uh, system is that you can, instead of working with the, the lights and memorizing all that stuff, you just get your phone out and plug in what you want it to change if you want it to change anything. And then, of course, you get your little tool set from Traxxas, your little four-way wrench, which, uh, in my opinion, uh, very valuable. Also, one of the easiest things to lose. And then these uh, Allen wrenches that nobody uses. Uh, you should just come in and buy an actual tool set so you can actually work on your stuff without stripping screws because that's the worst thing in the world. And then of course the instruction manuals that nobody reads. Uh, they're in there. You can always peruse them. Uh, again, I recommend putting them right next to your toilet. Uh, it's the best time to, uh, to take a look at the instruction manual and actually learn something. So that's it. That's all we got. This is the uh, 2021 TRX4 Ford Bronco from Traxxas. And, uh, I'm excited to get these in for you guys and get them out the door and start seeing them out on our course. Yeah. So there you go. Uh, make sure you subscribe, like, tell your friends, and uh, we'll make another video for you soon.